Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back. Today we're gonna be building a church and Roko actually sent in this idea So thank you so much as always guys if you want me to build anything Just let me know down below in the comments and I'll be sure to build it to start it off like any other build You want to lay out your plans on the floor down below and then try to replicate it as best as you can and make sure everything fits now I'm placing a lot of details you see all of those bits sticking out those are going to be types of walls that are going to stick out on the outside of the church. So I made sure that everything was correctly aligned and stuff. Now on the right, that's going to be a tower for the bell at the top. Then the, the thing at the top left is going to be the entrance of the church. Right here at the front there is going to be a huge window that I'm now creating a little bit of. And now I'm going to actually cut in a bunch of windows. Just tiny little windows all over the place. I like having lots of windows because it gives a lot of light. And I like that in a building. So I'm just making it a little bit higher because I'm going to be increasing the floor height over there. I placed in some wood. But later on I'm going to be changing this because I figured wood is not really the correct choice for a church. So there you go, a little part on the front, some stairs to walk up in. That's the entrance actually, like I just explained. Now I'm going to continue on building the wall that I started with. I'm going to make a huge window. I even made it too big to begin with, but I'll be correcting that later. So for now, I'm just lining out the roof, seeing where it ends up at the top. And I actually made a little mistake, so I'm going to be correcting that later on. I'm going to actually like move half of the building, move it a little bit more inward just so that I can create a nice little roof thingy because otherwise I would not have the perfect center block. Right now is going to be the moment where I moved it. So there you go. Everything has moved one block in just so that I can create a nice roof. And the window is actually nicely centered now as well. I'm going to make it a little less wide, but it will turn out amazing in the end. Trust me. So now we're going to create the walls. Just build it up a little bit with my quartz block. So it, this whole building is basically made in the same kind of block style. It's basically just quartz and some stone, cobblestone as roof materials. So here these windows are one by three and I have them all over the building. Then I'm going to create the front, actually like the stage part of the church. I'm not sure how you would call that, but it's where the ceremony and stuff takes place. I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. I just, I just don't know the word for it. So there you go. I made the tower a little bit taller and I'm also creating the other side of the roof. Because I want to fill in one side, just like I did yesterday with the barn. I want to keep a little bit of sunlight in just for the time lapse. Otherwise, this would be so dark on the inside. So here, I'm just creating that little tower, finishing it up and connecting it to the roof, filling in the last part of the roof. And now I'll just keep that open. Now, right now, in a moment, I'm going to be decorating most of this stuff inside the church. I'm going to be using a lot of banners and right now actually fill in that huge window. I was thinking about making like an awesome window with lots of colors which a lot of churches have but with minecraft colors it wouldn't look too good so i just left that out so there you go a little carpet like a red carpet going down i also just placed all of the benches and i just left a little bit on the front which is usually what churches have so we don't like literally sit in front of the ceremony thing so the carpet continues upstairs and the altar is going to be right there i just put like a couple torches and some banners on it i'm not a church guy I'm not religious, I have no idea what it looks like, all I'm going for is pictures and I think I'm doing quite a decent job at this. It's not perfect, like I said I'm not the best at decorating insides, I'm more a person that likes to build complex buildings and like mathematical buildings that turn out really well. Is that weird to explain? I don't know, but I just like doing that. So there you go, the inside is kind of almost done, the roof is now completely filled up and I'm going to continue on the front engine's little building. Now I'm going to increase the height by one because I made a little mistake and do a little small roof that is actually the same similar size as the big building so it's really simple. Place in a couple of windows and fill it in with glass, by the way the glass is dark it's kind of like a dark gray. I just, it fit the theme way better. Here you go. This is what I was talking about earlier. It's like a little design that lots of churches have. It's just like a pillar going up next to the wall. And right here we are creating what I think was the most fun is the big tower near the church. Now this thing is going to have like a bell at the top on the inside, which I'm going to make later. It's super fast, but I just created like a bunch of windows. This is by the way, all random. I'm just doing this out of my head based off of a couple pictures I saw and just doing random things that come into my mind and I think it turned out quite well. Now this roof is going to be redone like I made it like 
way too low the first try. Here you go, I made it way too low. Then I figured, let's increase the height of this baby. Let's make it huge and big. So right here is gonna be the moment where I am placing lots of cobblestone blocks and stairs on top of each other and finishing it off with a cobblestone wall and making a nice cross at the top. Now here also with some quartz I'm making sort of like two crosses on the end of the roofs and that is basically it from the outside. So here we are going to the entrance back again making a couple of doors now going back inside continuing with the carpet placing lots of decoration inside some paintings and decorating the roof. Now I'm going to be using some quartz stairs and just doing it in the pattern that I also did in the barn tutorial so it's kind of the same. But it's not the same. It's using stairs and otherwise I was using slabs, so it's a little bit different. There you go. That was a quick little demonstration of the bell that I made. It was super fast, but it's all I had to do. Now that window was placed down below and now I'm just finishing off a little bit of decoration inside of the church. Like this is not a hard build guys. You can do anything you want. And here I'm just replacing the, the weird torches. It was like placeholders. And now it actually look quite nice with a cobblestone wall and a little torch on top. And guys, that is basically it for this build. It was super simple to do, and I'm sure any of you can build this. It's awesome to do, it's lots of fun, and it looks quite nice in my opinion. Here you go, a nice overview of the entrance, and we're going to be curving up into the air for a nice last overview. Here we are back in the server and I just want to quickly still run around this building and show you everything in detail. So these little pillars that go up on each corner and like in between all the windows, I think those are a really, really nice touch and you can do a lot more with this. You can even like do something under the roof bit. Like there's so much you can do that I left out still because I want to do this in under an hour. This is what I can do in an hour and I don't want it to like be too long. You can do a lot of stuff with the roof as well. You could bring this out and make like a nice little overhanging bit like this and then have a like staircase like that. Like you could do so much. I'm not I'm not going to do it right now, but there's lots of stuff you can do to improve this, but I'm going to leave that to you guys. Also this entrance here could have been made quite a bit better and more uh, nice, but like I said, I don't want to bore you with too long videos, so here you go. Now this tower is quite my favorite. It's kind of cool with the little cross at the top. It looks so nice and cute, like I love it. Then we have the bell that I'm going to show you guys that because it was hard to see. Let's go inside over here. Let's go all the way in so you have a nice little overview of the inside. It looks quite cozy. It looks kind of nice. I like it. Even though I'm not the best at interiors like I said, I think it's still quite good. So the ropes to ring the bell is here and the bell is over there at the top. It's super simple, but it's kind of cool. And there you go, guys. That was how to make a little simple church. Like always, let me know down below what you want to see in the next video. If I pick your idea, I will shout you out in the next video like I did today. And thank you so much for watching. Leave a like rating if you've enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.